Good evening, guys. Today we are going to make ravioli ai funghi. So, mushroom with ravioli with creme fraiche. I choose the blue one. So, some white mushroom as well. The chicken fillet, bio. So, the olive oil, salt and pepper. So the recipe is going to be in total in 10 minutes. And uh, I would like to start it fast. So we pour some hot water in the pan. So in the meantime, the water is going to boil. We are going to make ready the sauce for the pasta. And uh, because the ravioli is fresh making, it just needs six minutes to cook. And in eight minutes, uh, the mushroom and the chicken is going to be done. So, I pour half of the pan. I hope you don't mind, I play some uh, non-copyright music. Just to not make it boring. Okay. So, I make the water in the temperature and now we are going to try. Cheers, by the way. Today that I'm trying this recipe is Sunday, it's 7 of uh, November. We are located in Amsterdam and uh, the time is uh, 7.30. Okay, so we have here the bucket from 250 gram of mushrooms. I prefer them to clean with a... Uh, with a tissue okay as you know the mushrooms cannot be washed because they are like sponge and they absorb the water and then we cannot fry so I'm going to cook for for two person but since we have a newborn baby a baby girl from three weeks my fiance is so hungry, then uh, I had to cook for three persons instead of two. Okay, so half of the package, that yeah, should be 150 gram of mushroom. Let's change the knife. Okay. I like to play with the traditional recipes, so I make a bit customized for myself. I feel more comfortable, so I like to chop in slices the mushrooms. Uh, I feel that they are better cooked. Then the big pieces. So the last one.
especially when you cook for somebody you love. It's much more beautiful. The cook, uh, so I'm uh, throwing in a pan. First the chicken, for a few seconds more than the mushroom. Okay, I will rinse my hands. I don't like the chicken sticky in my hand. So, okay. I suggest you in the pan using a wooden spoon. The way how I cook, I don't use the grams or the measures, I just do by eye. Okay, so I'm just going to grab the scissors and to add some more meat here. Me and my fiance, we are meat lovers. So I'm just going to chop it some more and more. I think uh, it's around like 200 grams. Okay. And if you see that it's going too fast, then you just make it the uh, heat more slow instead of the book the otherwise we mix burn the we may burn the the, the, the chicken okay I'm thinking to do my channel multiple tasks, so a lot of videos for cooking, for chilling around, tourism and viewing, I find quite interesting, that's why the channel is called Interesting Things All Over EU, because we love to fly everywhere. Okay, so you can add with the meat also some garlic and onion, but because it gives gases to the mommy, and then we don't need the baby to have gases in the little tummy, so I just go without garlic and onion, even then it's less flavor. Of course, I would prefer more. As I say in the beginning, the mushrooms become like spongy and they suck the oil and to not risk to get burned, just slow down the heat. You can use a gas or introduction plate like I have here. Okay, I see the oil is also boiling, so I just need from this moment six minutes to make ready the pasta, the sauce. So I'm deciding to put the ravioli in. They are filled up with mushrooms inside. I tried this brand before, it's, it's nice. Okay. I see the, the time to make it exactly. We 
like to add some some cheese and we have uh, all cheese here really salty and uh, one is uh, parmigiano reggiano and the other is grana padano so because the mushrooms become like sweet and with a creme fraiche I like to use the most old and salty cheese so we are going to use parmigiano today in the meantime I wait the mushrooms with chicken to get cooked here So we don't like so much salty and we keep biologies everything. I'm just going to add just a tiny bit of salt. I like the pink salt from Himalaya and some black pepper as well. Okay. mushrooms and chicken is almost done I grab a bowl and I'm going to try to make to prepare the the cheese. It found a lot of salt in the cheese, so that's why I love it to use a lot of cheese on top of the pasta of the ravioli. This is a simple recipe. You can do it in 10-15 minutes home without asking so much ingredients or time or not too much to put effort on it. We love the parmigiano, so I'm going to grain a lot here until it's enough. Okay, now I see the mushrooms. They just become with a bit golden color, kind of brownish. So it's going to look like this. I will make it low fire and add the creme fresh. So here it's found uh, 125 gram. out to see the fat container here so that is quite a lot it's 30 percent of fat and uh, you're going to need some burning calories after this it's a lot of protein and nutrition here Okay, almost in one minute we have done the pasta.
So I have it here, the parmigiana. I feel, I feel a little bit of the place where I work. I like to have everything prepared and ready and clean. Okay, one more minute. So I check the pasta by grabbing one, I put in the lid and I try to see if it's open easily and yes, so that means it's done. I'm going to turn off the plate here and making a minimum of the fire in the other one because the sauce is also ready. out the water from here pasta looks like this. I like to let a bit water on it so it's going to make it more creamy and I add to the pan where it was before. And then I make higher the fire again. So the flavor goes a lot on the pasta as well. I cook for one more minute here. Most of the time the recipe is just made by me, taught in the moment, every day is different. So I try to use the basic and plus some customize it. I have a good, uh, by the way, I have a good taster. So my fiance give me the note time after time and that is a lot of motivated to go further with the new recipes and okay you see until what uh, phase you want uh, creamy so I like to stay a bit creamy not so dry that means that I'm just going to turn off the, the plate here. Okay. And the 
this is the final plate. It could be looked like this. They say for the mushroom that is the the vegetable of the youth keeps your skin very tight and makes you look young all the time. So I suggest you eat a lot of mushroom. Okay, since the pasta is for two person, I'm going to use all of that. Parmigiano on top. Okay, so it takes 20 minutes from beginning until the end. I suggest you to try, it's so nice. With a glass of white wine. Enjoy guys. Bon appetit! See you to the next video!